Hello everyone. I am going to talk to you a little bit about updates on the aids that I use for my visual impairment. Two of these things are from Harbor Freight, which uh, hopefully you have one nearby. And this one was free with purchase. <laughs> they have coupons around all over the place for free items with purchase. So we just sort of saved them up and got these. I really like this kind of flashlight. They have another one that is commonly offered, but this one is amazing for someone that needs access to it easily, for one thing, because of the hook, which I can hook on any number of things, on wall hooks. I have it hooked on shelving. Um, I can even hook it into my shirt and wear it <laughs> like a little beacon if my hands are full. Um, it works by clicking once to get this sort of broader, bigger light, and then it turns off, and then you click it again, and there's a smaller light, which I don't find terribly useful because it's not bright enough for me. But I wanted to talk about the fact that having flashlights around everywhere <laughs> is really helpful, especially if you have a place in your house that you need to walk a distance in order to get to a light switch, which we do in our apartment, and that's where I use it the most. So that is my free Harbor Freight flashlight. Love these things. If you have to pay for them, then pay for them because, frankly, they're amazing. And they've held up really well. I haven't had any problems with them. So that's that. Next is this, which you guys got to see in my first video about my aids for my visual impairment. I was wearing it. It's a magnified headlamp, which the lamps burned out within one day, if you recall, and that makes them sort of useless, but it does have 4.5 magnification, which is awesome. The other issue that I had with it is that this is very hard plastic. So when I was wearing it, it would push against my head and give me a headache within the first 30 to 60 minutes. My husband got me the product and my dad put it together for me. Um, we put some pipe insulation on the part where your head goes. This stuff comes in rolls and you would normally wrap it around pipes to keep them insulated in the winter. So it's like a foamy stuff and it's sticky on the back so that's how it sticks to the pipes. I highly recommend if you're going to get this and alter it in the way that I have that you have a sighted person do this part for you because otherwise you're going to get it sticking to all kinds of stuff and you're not going to be able to see what you're doing. It was hard enough for my dad to do. So the, basically you put it on there and then you kind of trim it to fit. And this has been amazing. I'm so pleased with it. It is starting to wear down a little, but we can always put more on. Or if I have to buy a new one of these, it was $5. So um, I'm sure we could get this off and put another one on anyway. Putting this padding on here has allowed me to wear it all day with no discomfort whatsoever, which I think is totally awesome. Hello everyone. So now I'm going to show you my lamp that I'm super excited about. I got it at Home Depot and it's just a standard floor lamp but uh, in the back you can see that lamp that I was using that's battery powered which I'm keeping there because it makes a nice light if I need a night light, if I need to see something and I don't want to turn lights on, other lights. And of course it is perfect for claw clip storage. <laughs> As is this lamp though. I had one clipped in here too. Um, so 
it's just a standard floor lamp but I've never been so excited to have a lamp before because I can kind of now it's a little loose up here I can kind of swing it out over where I sit to do my work <laughs> on the computer and I can see the keyboard and it's bright it's wobbly because it's sitting on something um, I just thought I'd share that so that other people can see what might work for them I do have an LED 100 watt equivalent in there right now so I'm really pleased about that too so it means I shouldn't have to change it that often and the LEDs are doing a pretty good job at creating a quality of light that seems to not make glare but be bright. That's my lamp and I guess that's all of the things that I wanted to show you that are sort of updates on the aids I use for getting things done with the visual impairment. I will see you in the next video. Remember, love each other and be well.